make it fun. Are we filming? Oh, sorry. Uh, I think the fucking camera got jammed. Oh, I'm in Chatham. I'm in the car park. Well, I don't know which car park it is, but haven't they got a massive television? It's got a bigger one than me. Right? And um, I'm off to the Chatham Library by myself because I don't go to school. I'm a bit too old for that. And, um, well, I've just been, you know, it's been an OK day today, actually. I ain't had no sleep for two days because the mobile phone's been going off in my ear roll. And I actually had a migraine last night. And um, Well, what it is really is the fact that I've got to go to the library to check my bank balance because I've only got 50p in my bloody handbag. <laughs> and here it is, me ugly mug. Hello! As you can see, there is a fantastic white poodle dog over there. And I had to call someone saying, hello beautiful to me this morning. And if I was beautiful and I had loads of cash, do you think I'd be living down here? Because of course I wouldn't, I'd be in London, filming a film and doing some modelling work. But you see, my face resembles the back arse of a Doberman pincher. And I can't do that. <laughs> Woof. And you've got the bus drivers over there congregating. Usually smoking fags. <laughs> and this is a lovely riverside. And what happens is you'll be sitting down and you'll have to move because a load of cannabis smokers sit down here. And you see my eyes start running and my nose starts streaming and I have to go home. But in the library you can't do drugs and take... Well, you can take your own belief pouches in and sit down. But you can't smoke in the public building, which is a relief. Excuse me, I'm out of breath. I don't believe in the smoke or drink either. I don't know what it is. Could be heart trouble. I mean, the post nearly gave me a shock. Someone sending me a will in the post. I ain't got nothing to leave them unless they want some holy knickers and a pair of soulless shoes and some paperwork. They're quite willing to take that with them. Um, yeah well being a single lady I don't get much chance of going out on dates and they always say they're going to buy me food and it's not food which I actually eat and now I'll have to go off because I don't want to be rude <laughs>